to have someone that was cheerful taken, that uplifted a community, uh, you can't really replace that. Well, she's talking about a man that almost everyone knew in this Edgar County town, and now they're just trying to understand why he's gone. 59-year-old Charles Ney was beaten to death, and this happened last Thursday in front of his Paris apartment. 26-year-old Tyler Poole, who you'll see on your screen, is charged with his murder. WCIA 3's Ariana Williams will bring us more, including how that community saw this well-known man. Katie Craig of Paris, Illinois says Charles C.K. Ney was a man known for his kindness. And to find out he died so violently is a hard pill to swallow. You almost wonder, you know, why um, and, and what could have provoked something of that stature. Ney lived at Tiger Senior Living Apartments when he was attacked on July 20th. The next day, 26-year-old Tyler Poole was arrested. Part of me was proud, um, just for the simple fact of the small town, you know, police took action, got the appropriate people, made the arrest as quick as possible. Ney was a speaker at Craig's grandfather's funeral. She says a crime like this almost never happens in Paris, and especially to people like Ney. He knew no stranger. Um, he was going to help anybody he could through the time of need. Even if he didn't have it himself, he was going to take those steps to help others. Ney's neighbor, who wants to stay anonymous, says she was outside when the attack happened. She says she watched as first responders were trying to help Nay, but when she saw his arm fall on the gurney, she knew something was wrong. For someone like that in our community to be taken is very devastating. Nay's neighbors say what the community will miss most is his ministry. Craig says it'll be his smile. Both say it's heartbreaking because Nay couldn't have seen it coming. We just need to make sure we look forward and we come together, we support one another and try to unfortunately, you know, move past the devastation and celebrate him. And so we do also know that Poole is being held on a half a million dollar bond and there is a preliminary hearing set for August 7th.